thank you for taking the time to speak with me, Stuart. Um, Happy to be here. Thank you. I believe you had a presentation recently that you were quite pleased with, and I'm curious about what the content of that was. Um, that was on a, uh, an international symposium on um, systemic leadership. And so I would, uh, really the, the underneath things that affect leadership. So quite often people learn techniques. Mm. Um, but most of those techniques about, are really about how to be better managers, not leaders. Leaders um, need to be beyond techniques. It's a, um, it's very, it is very much a systemic thing and it's tied up with wisdom. So wisdom isn't something you can learn. It's something no, that that's so disappointing. you develop through experience. <laughs> I was hoping you could give me some. Well, there, there's very little, little you can teach. Um, I think Lauren, um, Lawrence Lashan said, you know, when you boil it all down, you have a choice of acting on love or acting on fear. And that's, that's a little piece of wisdom that you can actually bring to people's attention. But to actually be able to do it um, doesn't come from being taught it. <laughs> Right, so if I'm in a situation of despair about the climate crisis, and I believe there might be other people that share the same despair, how do I act um, with love and not fear? Um, mostly by listening to them. That's the key. Um, and, and and listening to other people, um, usually people listen enough so they can then speak. And the real test for listening is when people have said something, to say, can you say some more about that? <laughs> Which means you're not sitting there waiting to speak. <laughs> okay. So can you and tell me a bit more about when that? They've answered, and then when they've answered, um, to do it again. <laughs> that could be a, a, a long pause in the conversation. Yeah. But, and but, you, could, you could then finally say, are there any questions that you want to ask me about? <laughs> wow. Are there any questions? So that's, yeah, that's, that's about wisdom. Mm. Most people ha are, are very, very far from wisdom because we don't, we don't um, enable wisdom in schools. We enable cleverness. Yeah. And we, all our exams are based on cleverness. And if you look at the, the total picture of knowledge, if you imagine it as an enormous circle, um, there's a, and put a dot in this circle, the dot is the sum total of human knowledge, and that's what we teach, and that's what we do exams on. The rest is experience and feelings and wisdom and gut sense and all the rest of it. Um, and so, if you're going to actually responsibly engage with one another and ecosystems, you've actually got to find some way to, to tune into that, that other stuff, which is not the cleverness bit. No, but most of us are trained in cleverness. Yeah, and even people who teach permaculture are te teaching mostly cleverness. Yes. And many of us are told to suppress all the other things that you mentioned, the experiences yeah. and the feelings and intuition and gut, gut responses. Um, and I, 
I wonder if it's a privilege to still stay in touch with those things, possibly because I've had enough resources to and allow me the leisure time to toy with things that are not normally permitted. Yeah. So we, yeah, I think, I think that, and there's also a gender factor that women generally are better at doing that than men. <laughs> well, I live in a family of mutes, actually. I married a mute and his children are quite quiet and his brothers and sisters are very quiet. And one would assume that that makes you a good listener, but they suppress their gut feelings and I, I think that's pretty normal. Hmm. Yeah. Where do you see yourself in this process of listening? Do you get frustrated? Um, well, some of the time I, I, I don't do what I say. <laughs> no. So, <laughs> so I, I break my own rules. So, um, and then when I do, I get frustrated. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, it's just that your internet connection is unstable. I don't know. Is that mine? I don't Possibly. Know. So, yeah. Well, let's round this up and start a new question in just a moment. Okay. okay. Yep. Yeah.